Today I'd like to show you how do you extend the site themes in SharePoint Foundation using PowerPoint. Uh, out of the box you will get a certain number of themes which may or may not suit your particular needs. Let's just have a look. Uh, to access the site themes, it's site actions, site settings will bring you up to this page and you go into the look and feel site theme. So let's open that. Here you have all the themes out of the box and the current theme which is a customized theme being used for this site. So you just browse through those and apply them and see if that's what you want. And if not, here you have the option of extending these. Now in SharePoint Enterprise you can modify these themes directly on the page and you can, you can choose your fonts and how your text is going to appear on the page but SharePoint Foundation only offers limited capability for doing this. Let's have a look and how you can customize these themes. So I'll open PowerPoint for you, a blank PowerPoint presentation and up in the ribbon you'll see colors. Let's have a look at those and you have the idea here of creating new theme colors. So here's where you modify your colors so you can change the background you can change the followed hyperlinks, the hyperlinks, for example, and the accents, the text backgrounds, and so forth. And here in the sample, you get a bit of an idea about how that's going to appear on the screen. This is, I'm going to save this for future reference, maybe test theme three. Now I'd like to save this theme into just into a folder on my server so that I can upload it into SharePoint. So I'll just choose my pictures and themes and here this one test theme 3 and it's saved automatically as an office theme. So we'll save that and then we're going to go into SharePoint and upload it. So back to the site themes, go to the theme gallery, which you'll see the link is there on the page. And here you, you will see all the themes that are already uh, loaded into the SharePoint themes and you have the option of adding a new item. So click on that, browse to the theme that you just saved, open it and click OK. You can add a description. and save it here. And there you'll see test theme 3. So let's go back to our themes and I'll just ref back to site settings, back to site theme and you'll see test theme 3 is now there and this is how it appears. So let's go ahead and apply that and see how it looks. There you go, so that's the dark blue that I just selected and you'll see the followed hyperlinks are in this purple color, so that doesn't look too bad actually. So when you have particular colors that you want to match, for example, to your logo or to your company colors, that's a good way of introducing those colors. If you have any question, you can go to www.p3connect.com.au to find my contact details. Thank you for your time.